Oh, give her the remote. I found this remote in the office, but I'm pretty sure the batteries won't fit. It needs the big stumpy ones. Yeah, these are no good. What else? Can we take the uh Doc, have you got any Lee, batteries? Maybe punching him wasn't such a good idea. There were worse plans. Says the guy who didn't get punched in the mouth. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank Battery you. on the shelf? Really? Are you guys alright? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Doc? We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves. Over we it. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice that killed Sean. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment. When things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Try to let it go. Yeah, it seems like Duke's got PTSD already. He seems to have gone a little bit mute. Alright, let me get back to the shelf. Find these batteries that I've walked past. Right there, isn't it? You f freaking Hawkeye. Oh, would you look at this? I found some batteries. Boom. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. Don't sound too happy about it, will you? I'm still looking for batteries for that day. Uh, thanks. I appreciate it. It was one battery. I need another. Anybody Looks got like a battery in here? A chance to donate anything before this all went down. Maybe in the office then? There's no more batteries out here. Well, none that I saw. <laughs> Can't search in the drawer anymore. God damn it. Batteries? Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. It's Dad's TV. That's what I figured. My parents came in here hoping to survive. There's literally so nothing else in here until we get the keys, then. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Hmm. Go back in. <clears throat> There's a couple more things to talk to about. Let's go see. Maybe he found a battery? It's all melted now. Hey, Doug. How are we doing? What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so... We ought to wait for things to clear up. You no, said your I can't search the desk anymore. Them? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? I don't know. Well, wouldn't they be I don't really want to tell somewhere them. like that? Cat, it's not our business. Uh, I'm not sure they made it. We passed some houses on the way in, and things are pretty bad here. Well, you just don't know. How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? I'm not going around telling everybody her family's dead. She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What were you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. Oh. Better get back to getting this guy. She's a badass. Mm. Take your time. Mm -mm -mm. Do 
you thought they would have um, said something. What does it keep telling me these flipping greeting cards are for? No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead cards. Oh, hilarious. Hey, Doug. I know it's random, but have you got a battery? How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? No. Not now. All right. I found this remote in the office, but I'm pretty sure the batteries won't fit. It needs the big stumpy ones. Yeah, these are no good. I have I just got to talk to her again? Am I being stupid? Hey, Connie. I'm still looking for batteries for that thing. Thanks. I appreciate it. <laughs> better get back to it. Yep. Is there a battery That's outside? Right. Don't mention it. Just remember what I said. Yeah. I will. Oh, Doug. Good. Want to go have a look around outside? I guess so. Means that's Let's our only other option. Around. Okay. Oh, hello. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? Change the frequencies. Don't launch it. It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Hey! Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Well, you should say it be right. any more insulting. That got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. And they don't care. So that was that. What's Did you that? guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Unlucky! Oh, I don't think... Sesame. That won't work. I was kidding. It's universal, but... It looks unlocked. I know, Doug. I don't want to use the axe on it. How did you do that quietly? Carefully. I can't reach that brick. Can you make any more noise? Do the brick. Furthest away from where the dude is. Surely that's going to lure him in. Ooh, baby. Now's the time. Go get the key. Run. Be careful. Talk. What are you actually doing here? He's literally doing nothing. He reprogrammed the remote, that's it. Hey, bud. Is this his brother, I assume? I don't know what happened to Mom. So it was a family photo? Yeah. I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, yeah. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Shoot him a second. I got to do this now, man. I got to do this. It's the right thing to do. In the head, not the neck. God damn it. Fuck. 
Dude, you're useless at this. Is it really going to keep giving me the uh, the night shot here? Finally. Freaking useless. There we go. Holy crap! Run! What? Why shot you, loser? There's no padlock now. Probably wasn't the best idea chopping that off. Barricade the door. Man, that was close. But we did it. That's all that matters. Dudes, the freaking bars are open. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Well, wow. let's get in, in there. She seems to have changed her tune now. Right, in we go. Quickly. Yep. I'm hoping there's going to be a battery in here as well. Oh no. Oh, shit. We gotta hurry. That doesn't seem good. How did he not know? Oh look, she's got a convenient killing tool. It's literally just called drugs. Come on, baby, time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. I that door's not locked anymore. Shit! You three, get on it! I'll get back as fast as I can! Stay away from the windows. Glad we need your help, please. Hey, Lee! If we don't make it through this, I should know that I think you're a great guy. Cheers, dude! We will make it through this! Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know! <laughs> I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit! On it. Are you sure? Oh, shit! What? Oh, shit! Save Doug! Okay, then. Kimita, can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Kimita, did you find Wait. anything? Nothing! Wait! That window is screwed! Go! <laughs> I found something. Oh, the cane. Good thinking, Batman. No, 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 no. She's got the gun. Save her. She saves Doug. Surely. Although I bet I save her, he gets pulled through the window more like. She's got a gun just freaking shooting. No. Save dog. Oh my god. As if she's kept a pistol. With no fucking ammo in it. No! Screwdriver! Did he just pivot on its head? 
Uh, excuse me, motherfucker. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. I thought he just killed me. Big <laughs> sense. Especially a good friend. Kenny's our man, it seems. Oh, that got a bit intense. Holy shit. Is that the end of a chapter by any chance? It seems like it's the end of a chapter. Yeah, his heart did recover nicely. They probably found him the meds while he was giving us the cutscene. Yummy. Wait, was that duck talking? He recovered quickly. I assumed it was going to be somewhere obvious with Raven saying if you looked everywhere up and down. Ugh. I thought it was going to be in the back room. I thought we needed to get in there with the key and it'd be in there, but... Hey, Glenn. Never mind. God damn it! She was hiding it. Couldn't she have passed it, me? Oh, look, here's a battery. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's no, happening. No, glad. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. I know what happens to you in the long run. Oh, brownie face. You gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I wanted him to stay, but... You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. Like the girl from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah. He but really didn't like that, did he? you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. Hopefully me not complaining about him leaving comes back in a good way later on. Like Glenn comes in and saves me. Yep, Duck's not showing up now, is he? Only Close cramp. call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. Where's the freaking dick bag gone that punched me? How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. You had the gun. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. I'm sorry, Carl. It's okay. Thanks, though. There's been a lot of death in the past few days. You anyway, just met him? I'd rather be alone, I think. Unless she knew something that we didn't. She's the reporter. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. Because you had the gun. I thought you'd save him. I was going to help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, 
I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Curly. Clementine looks like she needs him to be punched. <laughs> he looks like he also needs to be punched. Super Dinosaur was toast. But you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then? Hey, Duck. And then? want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry. There's not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. Mm -hmm. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. I knew she was going to say now that. Now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. That's why I wasn't going to say it's just walkie-talkie. Lee, come here for a second. Hmm. Let me go deal with this. Oh man, Clementine, another thing. <laughs> Unlucky. What do you, want? you like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me, so. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. Oh. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are, and I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Yeah, I'm a murderer. Are you trying to annoy me? Oh no. You know what, screw him. If it gives me the choice, I'm going to talk to him. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. <clears throat> that guy Doug is dead because of me. Do you not think she looks a bit like Maggie in the face? I don't know. We're lucky to have you. Just Maggie with longer oh, that's hair. That's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Yay. And they all lived happily ever after. And there goes the power. To be continued. Next time on The Walking Dead. <laughs> I should narrate the episodes. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Oh, we got Howdy. a gun? I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. I don't even know who these people are. What the? No more, please! No more, please! Lee, please! Okay. Ah! <laughs> mm uh, you and sixty-three percent of players were honest. Players chose a duck. That they're all nearly fifty-fifty, apart from the last one. Nobody likes Doug. That's just harsh. Gave Irene the gun. Side with Kenny. I mean, obviously we're going to side with Kenny. We've been around him longer. Cool.
cool. I'm, I'm quite into this now. I, I, I need to do the next one. Not. Go has the gap. She did. She could have saved Doug. That was my thinking. She reloads the gun. Well, I, I thought the gun was freaking loaded to start with, but yeah, she saves herself and then quickly just shoots across and doesn't shoot Doug straight in the face. It's that so. Zoom game. Yeah, I, I actually think I'm just going to be doing the next one anyway. Like I say, not today though. Is that all of this game? Or is that just one part of this game that I've done there? <clears throat> this is just the first one. Well, credits would tell you that it's the entire game done. I'm going to have to get season two. But it did say that I'd got them installed, unless I was uh, understanding it incorrectly. Cop, Duke, Irene, Shep. Oh yeah, what happened to Shep? He just gone? He went back to his mum's, didn't he? Well, if she was a zombie then, he's a zombie now, I guess. Oh, special thanks. Surely we're getting near the end now. I'm just curious to see if I've uh, got to buy the next what, game to do the next bit. Which I'll happily do. Credits over. Have a look. So, that's the next one, right? Which, apparently, I have, I, I have got. Cool! Well, I think next Sunday we're going to have to continue this story. Carry it on from um, where we've left off here. Like I say, I quite enjoyed that. It's different. Not done a, have I done a story game? I don't think I've done a story game on this or YouTube. By this, I mean Twitch. But, uh, either way... That's where we're going to uh, wrap this stream up. So uh, thank you guys for coming and watching. Hopefully you've all enjoyed it. Any of you guys on Twitch that have enjoyed it, if you look in the description below, there's links to Patreon, uh, Discord, and YouTube. And if you're watching this on YouTube, in the description below, there are links to Patreon, Twitch, and Discord. So uh, yeah, go have a look at those. Hopefully you all enjoyed it, like I say. And uh, other than that, I guess I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.